Hi, it's Andy Phillips here from Internet Marketing Whiz Kids, and I've been asked to do a guest blog for Becky for her socialgeekiness.com blog. And I'm going to do something a little bit special. What I'm going to do, I'm going to show you some hints and tips and tricks that we use as social media marketers and social media managers for companies. Um, how we actually get consistency across brand. So your very first step in making sure that you have a consistent brand name across all platforms is first to make sure that the URL is free. Now we've chosen this one as what we're going to be uh, trying to get a consistent name across all platforms for. We're going to uh, use training to swim. Now I'm not going to use this. If anybody wants to use this, that's fine. Um, but we're going to use this as our blog title. Now, to make sure that it's available, I'm just going to take the spaces out very quickly. And so we've got an all one word in there. So we'll do that. And what we'll do is we'll just see if it's available. And that is available. So trainingtoswim.com is available. So we'll use that. And we now we just want to make sure that training to swim is now available across all the social media platforms that we have. So what we do is we go to this site, which is called namecheck.com, namecheck.com. And what we do here is it's actually called namechk.com, but uh, it's called namecheck. So what we're going to do is we're going to stick our uh, our chosen name that we want to be consistent across all platforms for and we're just going to paste into that so we've got training to swim in there and all we do now is we quite simply hit this little green button and it will go to all the different social media platforms and we're talking about Facebook and Twitter and FriendFeed and Google and Vimeo uh, all the ones, Tumblr, Twitter, all, every single one you can think of even WordPress and it's available and it will go and check all these different ones. Now, StumbleUpon, it says it's taken. I know for a fact it probably isn't because the way StumbleUpon uh, works, there is only a certain amount of letters that you can actually put into a username, and that probably exceeds it. So we'll probably have to change that if we want to go to StumbleUpon. But the main point is that we've got Twitter, we've got uh, FriendFeed, Foursquare, you know, all these ones that are really probably the most important ones are all in here. So now you know um, that it's available across these platforms, you have a consistency, which is absolutely amazing. So, first off, go to GoDaddy, make sure that you've got the .com is available, and go for the .com rather than the .co.uk if you possibly can. It just SEOs a lot better, or it. Um, helps with search engine optimization um, and then go to this namechk.com or namecheck.com and see if it's available across all platforms.